Okay, let's look at this uh, example here. So you ask to find the area between uh, x axis and the graph fx equal to x square minus 1. Okay, so this is the graph of x square minus 1. You have the parabola with the concave outwards. And then you shift uh, 1 below the x axis. So you have here the y intercept. Okay. And then from x equal to 0 to x equal to 2. So we must to find where is the region um, for this area. Okay. So this is your a curve. And then you ask to find from 0 to 2 means that if you can see here, 0 to 2 is somewhere here, means that you have two regions here. Okay, if I can note this as region 1, and then this as region 2. Alright. So how to find the area here? Okay. So, first of all, um, you need to have uh, another information. The x-intercept here. Okay, so how to find the x-intercept represent by negative 1 and 1 here, very easy. So to find the x-intercept, you know that uh, all the value of y equal to 0 at the cross-section of your x axis here. So we let uh, x square minus 1 equal to 0. Therefore, you will get x square equal to 1, which will give you uh, x equal to plus minus 1. Okay, so that's why you have uh, x equal to negative 1 here and x equal to 1 here. Alright, so let's find the area represented by R1 and also R2 here. So I will share with you two uh, alternatives on how to find the area. Okay. So let's start with the first alternative. Okay. So your area is equal to R1 plus R2, okay? So the first alternative is R1 is the area below the x-axis. So remember, we must to have the absolute sign. So we will find the integration together with the absolute sign here. So you will integrate from 0 to 1. Okay, 0 to 1 of this function, eh? x square minus 1 respect to x. Okay, don't forget the absolute sign. And then plus, uh, the second region here is the area above the x-axis. So, we don't, we don't need to have the absolute sign. So we must to find, we evaluate the integral from 1 to 2 of your function fx, which is x square minus 1 with respect to x. Okay. So integrate this, you should have x cubed over 3 minus x. From the limit 0, 1, and then with the absolute sign here. And then plus for this one, we have the same function. x cubed over 3 minus x from the limit to 1 to 2. Okay, so substitute the uh, lower and upper limit here. So don't forget your absolute sign. So we have 1 over 3 minus 1 and then minus with 0 okay and then plus um, 
8 over 3 minus with 2 minus with 1 over 3 minus 1. So 1 over 3 minus 1, you should have negative 2 over 3 here. And then plus 8 over 3 minus 2, so you should have 2 over 3. Okay. And then here you should have minus, uh, minus 2 over 3. So we open the bracket here, so we should have 2 over 3 and then plus with 2 over 3 plus 2 over 3, you should have 4 over 3. So it gives you 6 over 3 or simplify this, you should get 2 unit square. Okay, so this is your solution. So this, uh, if we use the first alternative. So, based on second alternative, okay, by using second alternative, okay, same, we have A area equal to region 1 plus region 2. So, in region 1, if I share from the previous slide, okay, so we need to integrate from 0 to 1 for this uh, function here. As the x as this, your y equal to 0, so you will have 0 minus, so you minus everything below this curve here. Okay, so minus x square minus 1. Alright, and then you plus with integrate from 1 to 2. Okay, so you have everything here below the graph. Means this is your upper graph. Okay, so x square minus 1 and then you minus the area below this x axis mean your y equal to 0 so you minus 0 okay so now we have a uh, simplify here okay so what we have here is a negative x square plus 1 okay I missed the dx here so we should have dx And then plus uh, integrate 1 to 2, x square minus 1, dx. So let's uh, evaluate this uh, first integral here. So we should have negative x cubed over 3 plus x from the limit 0, 1 and then plus x cubed over 3 minus x. So substitute the limit. So we have here is a negative 1 over 3 plus 1 and then minus 0 for the a lower limit here. And then plus 8 over 3 minus 2 minus 1 over 3 minus 1 okay so here we have negative 1 over 3 plus 1 is uh, 2 over 3 and then what you have here is a uh, plus 8 over 3 minus 2 so you have 2 over 3 and then 1 over 3 minus 1 is uh, negative 2 over 3 and then you have minus here. So plus 2 over 3. 
So it means that you have 6 over 3. So equal to 2 unit square. Okay. So you can see we have the same uh, result here. Either by using first alternative or second alternative. Now we look at this uh, example. I select uh, one problem from the final examination 2015-2016 semester 2. So you ask to find the area of the region between the x axis. So this is your x axis. And the graph of y equal to 2x two cubed. So we have a curve represent the cubic function. Okay, all the curve here is your y equal to 2x two cubed. Then from x negative 1 to 1, yeah, as shown in figure 2. So where is the region represent um, the area mentioned in this um, equa uh, in this equation here? So it means that uh, the region is bounded by the x axis and also uh, y equal to 2 x cubed. From negative 1 to 1 means that we have two regions here. So I note this as region 1 and then this is as region 2. So if you can see here, your region 1 is actually the area below x axis. Okay. And then your region 2 is the area above x axis so i will use the first alternative in order to find this uh, area so the area is given by summation these two region uh, r1 plus r2 so for the r1 since the region is um, below this x axis then we need to evaluate our integral together with the absolute sign here. So we evaluate from negative 1 to 0 of your function uh, y here, which is 2x cubed. Okay, with respect to x. And then plus for region 2, no need to have absolute sign because um, area above the x axis. So the area is given by evaluate the integral from 0 to 1 of your function 2x cubed dx okay so let's simplify this so evaluate this integral you should have 2x power 4 which is x power 4 over 2 okay so from the limit uh, negative 1 0 and then plus the same we evaluate this integral to x cubed, so you have 2x power 4 over 4, which is x power 4 over 2. So now we substitute the limit, so we have 0 minus, okay, negative 1 power 4 over 2, and then plus Uh, 1 power 4 over 2 minus 0. So negative, negative 1 power 4, we give you positive 1. So we have positive half here, okay, together with the absolute sign. And then plus uh, 1 power 4 is always 1 plus half. Okay, now you open the absolute sign here, so we should have half plus half which give you equal to 1 unit square. Okay, so the uh, total area given by region 1 plus region 2 is equal to 1 unit square. You may try to use uh, the second alternative, okay? And then you should get uh, the same uh, result here, right? Now let's look at this uh, example. 
you have to sketch the curve x equal to negative y squared plus 9 then find the area between the curve and y axis over the interval x between negative 3 and 3 okay so this is our curve and then this is the area region so if you sketch so remember as I uh, share with you the revision on how to sketch um, this graph okay if uh, negative y square so we should have this graph then if we shift 9 then we should have this graph okay or in other words this is our graph huh? So this is the region, okay, because we want um, to find the, the area evaluate uh, under this curve, okay, and then bonded also with the um, y axis here, okay, now we are focusing on this y axis, and then from the limit uh, negative 3 and 3, yeah. okay, so this is a um, there is a typo here this here should be positive okay so this one is positive so this one should be negative here okay so from a uh, negative 3 to 3 here so how to find the area so the area now equal to integrate from negative 3 to 3 okay now we focusing on y means that this is your function but now with respect to dy here okay so I will write this integral we should have negative y cube over 3 plus 9y so from negative 3 to 3 here so now substitute the limit Okay, so what uh, we should have So it's equal to 36 unit square. Right? So I think that's all for this um, subtopic.
So you can try this uh, test your understanding and also the tutorial. Okay, that's all. Thank you.